Hi everyone, how are you doing? Welcome back to my video. Welcome back to my video. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you're doing well. My hair is getting out of control, but I think I like it. Um, we're going to do a new style soon, I think, which I'm excited about. Um, anyway, this video is long overdue. It should have gone up last week, but classic me. I broke my phone, didn't I? So I was four, five days out without my phone, which for me personally actually benefited me a lot. I feel like it was the universe's way of telling me to slow things down. You don't always have to be online. You don't always have to be checking up on everyone constantly all the time. You need a bit of me time. Um, but even though it is important to check up on people, not the, to the extent that I was. Um, but yeah, my phone's back to normal now. Um, I'm so excited to film this video. As you can see by the title, me and Zoe have been wanting to film a new video together for a while and I was just like, how can we do this? So, best friend controls my life. Nope. <laughs> best friend controls my day over FaceTime. I've gotten ready, obviously, because I was like, I just want to be me. So yeah, without further ado, let's get straight into the video. What's that on my chin? Oh. Um, let's see what Zoe's up to and let's see what she has planned for us today. Hi, bitch! Here she is! <laughs> yes. oh, firstly, I miss you. Oh, I miss you too. Look at your little face. You can see me. See you, your camera works. I know, I've just had a mare and I? I'm just putting this on. A Mark Ferris mare. Oh my god, this is going to be so cool. Your hair looks lovely by the way. Thank you, I just styled it. Haven't got to my face yet, but... Okay, so you know why I'm ringing you. have already put an outfit on, which I'm about to make you change. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Take me to your wardrobe, I want to see what you've got. <laughs> Here we go. My wardrobe. Okay. It's like sort of my night out outfits. Yeah. And then all my PJs and dirty washing down there. Okay, so... I might just have to go by... What's that pink? What's the pink thing? What, in here? Yeah, that, that pink... Is it a jumper? This is the jumper, yeah. What about your dungas? Oh. With a little white t shirt on me. Um, let me see if I can find them. <laughs> oh, piss. Dungarees? Yeah. And I got a white t shirt under this. Okay, put that on. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Are you having a good start to your day? Best start to the day. I've had a little bit of a PlayStation go. Oh, nice. Was I allowed to do that? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can do that. Are you still up for doing the live later? Yeah, of course. Amazing. We're still going to do the pamper thing or just like normal? Yeah, I reckon. We can just chat and then also just do a little face mask or something. Oh, I love it. Is that alright? It's white. Let's have a look. Oh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, love it. Do you want them both up, one down? How do you want it? One down. One down. But if it gets annoying, put it back up. Okay. Cool. How do you feel? I feel I feel loose. <laughs> <laughs> like I like the fact that that it's not tight. It's not restricting. Yeah. I oh, like it. An airy. Right. Take me to your fragrances. Oh oh <laughs> oh no. <laughs> You're gonna have to see my bloody bathroom. <laughs> oh my bathroom, guys, is such a mess. Uh. It's not Where ideal. All your They're all scattered everywhere. Okay. What's that yellow one? This one is called Amouage Sunshine. Who's, who's that by? I think Amouage, yeah. Oh, I've never seen that. What's that one with the big old black fluffy ball on it? Oh, so this is Ariana Grande's, uh, her brother um, perfume called Frankie. Her brother, her brother perfume. Her brother perfume. <laughs> Okay, no, not that one. I've got clean, which is like called skin. Oh, maybe one of those. Yeah, I love a clean fragrance. So, I think you'll like this actually. This is proving to be very hard to film. <laughs> <laughs> skin and vanilla. Oh. Oh, you're not even showing me, sorry. I'm showing you the no, back. That's all right. 
Okay, yeah, go for that. Okay. It adapts to your skin. So this, I love stuff like that. Yeah, so this would smell differently on you. How many pumps? Oh. As many as you want. <laughs> so now with your hair, I want you to do a centre party. <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> but the, the centre party is coming. I think you look amazing when your hair's like that. Thank you. I'm just growing it out a little bit longer. It looks great. Thanks, Widow. Okay, right, so you're probably a bit hungry, yeah? I'm starving. Okay, let's go to the kitchen. Okay. I did have to have a sausage roll to take my tablets, though. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> tablets, by the way, guys, are just for vitamins. Um, Were you going to say vitamins? Vitamins. They're just vitamins. Okay. I'm going to put you in the old cupboard. Hello. So what do you... <laughs> That's what you'll be doing to me by the end of the day. <laughs> but for breakfast, I've got um, eggs. I've got toast. I've got... Um, tuna, beans, honey, cereal. Oh, I reckon the combination of all of those. Oh no, okay. <laughs> I'm joking. I don't mind. So you know how I do my eggs where I take the shell off? Yeah. So I want you to do toast. Yeah. Two boiled eggs. Why? Right. Then take the shell off. Dippy eggs. Put on, put, no, pop them on your toast. And then cut into then it. Cut in it and it like runs out. I've never done that before in my life. You'll you'll be great at it. <laughs> it's just boiled eggs, but you just take the shell off. Okay. And then you I want you to put a bit of paprika on the top. Paprika eggs. Right. Yeah? Uh, uh, just on toast and that's it? Yeah, just on toast. Two Can eggs, bit of toast, bit of paprika. Can I butter the toast? <laughs> yes you can. <laughs> <laughs> You've got this. I'm excited. What can I drink? Have you had anything today yet? <laughs> <laughs> he had a little coffee. Well, I'm not going to want to tell you to drop another one straight away. <laughs> um, what about... Do you have any fruit? Can you make a smoothie? I can make a smoothie. Okay, love, thanks so much. I'm going to get cracking. <laughs> Here we go. Okay, so we've got toast. We've got... Okay, let me just put my toaster on. I don't actually have a toaster, I have a, what's it called, oven. This is absolutely stunning. Two slices, I mean they're thin, but they just do the job. Alexa, two minutes please. Two minutes, starting now. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. I've only got blueberries. Can I have a blueberry smoothie? Oh, 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 okay. Alexa, four and a half minutes, please. Four minutes and 30 seconds, starting now. Okay. Right, <laughs> let's make this blueberry smoothie. I've never had like an all-in-one smoothie, but today we're gonna have to do it. Oh God, I don't know how this is gonna taste, you know. I feel like this is like ready, steady cook and I'm like rushing around. <gasps> I just unplugged my Alexa. Oh no! Damn it! What's it? What do you reckon that is now? Three and a half minutes? Oh man! Oh, it's all gone tits out. <sighs> okay, oh my god, the Alexa's back on the timer still going. Two and a half minutes! Oi! Oi! And I've told him <laughs> what I want him to make for breakfast. <laughs> Hope it's going well, Mark. You've not called me yet, so... <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, love. The blueberry smoothie. Have you watched Safe on Netflix? Yes! Oh, she can't hear me. I just put it on silent. Sorry, Zoe, love you. The blueberry smoothie and water ain't that bad. Now, I've heard that blueberries are really good for the old skin and anti aging, and you know me. I love that sort of stuff. So, give me all the blueberries. We've got 42 seconds to go. Go, go. <laughs> I'm hyper. This is really nice, you know. Oh my god, I love that. Oh my god. Oh my god. Bowl of cold water. Oh my god, I forgot the bowl of cold water. Alexa, shut up. Alexa, stop. Sorry, let me say shut up. <laughs> okay, okay. Into the cold water. Everyone, calm down. Oh, the toast is looking fabby dabs. <gasps> oh my god, I think I've done it. I think I've done it. I think I've done it. Can you see me? <laughs> oh no, the, the head came off. 
Oh, sugar. Oh my God. Damn it. I think you need to be more aggressive with the peel. Oh. Oh my, and I forgot the paprika. Uh, that one was a bit of a fail because I don't think I left it in the cold water too long. But this one, hello. Mmm, so glad I didn't forget to put the paprika on. 10 out of 10. Blueberry smoothie. Eggs on toast. With a bit of paprika. Great start to the video. I told him what to make for breakfast. And he's smashed it. Yay! I just want to check if Zoe is still alive because I don't want to start ringing her. Hello, love. Hello, sweetheart. What do I do now? Okay. I reckon go for your daily walk. <gasps> A mid morning walk? Yeah, because it's so nice outside right now. Okay. It's so nice outside. Um, I think it would be nice to do it now. Where do you want me to go? Oh, I don't know your part. <laughs> Where you walked around and there was meant to be, there was like, you said you rolled down that hill once. <laughs> the part that I fell down the hole in. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> how long do you want me out for? Um, I mean, how long are people allowed? I think it's about an hour, isn't it? What does Boris say? <laughs> I texted Boris last night and he said he can go out for like an hour. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Take some pictures. Listen to um, a Shagged, Married, Annoyed podcast. Okay. Love it. Okay, cool. Also, I'm so proud of your eggs. Didn't they look amazing? You fucking smashed that. That's your egg. You've what? got to do that. <laughs> Bye. Bye. Slag. No. Snag. No. Shag, Marry, Avoid. Episode one. Go for a walk. Um, okay. Let's do it. So guys, I've arrived at the park. Um, like Zoe briefly said at the start, my friend used to live over there. And this one time I was going to meet them in the pub, which is on the other side of the park. But as usual, I was taking too long to get ready. And it was really dark. So I just started running and running through the park because I was scared. Forgot there was a massive hill, came rolling down this. Ran, 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 lost my stepping again and rolled all the way down into this. But at the time there wasn't water there, thank God. Bum bag's been open this whole time. Where's my wallet? Oh my god, where's my wallet? Oh, it's here. Hey guys, um, like I said on my Instagram story the other week, if you don't follow me, make sure to follow me, please. Little plug. Um, before YouTube, I used to make horror films, and this was a prime location for a little horror film because it's spooky and I feel like Pennywise lives in there. God, what a couple of months this has been, eh? Like, this is going to be taught in schools. Um, it's just crazy, isn't it? And I just feel like, I don't know, like I said, when I was speaking to my mum earlier, so I'm not, not exactly enjoying it, because there's obviously things that everyone needs to be doing in life. Um, but I am starting to get used to it, magpie. Um, yeah, I am starting to get used to it and sort of like falling back in love with my own company and enjoying like me time and like I said when my phone went down that was like four days of like no contact like I had to ring my mum and dad through Facebook <laughs> um, and I talked to them so much you don't realise how much you rely on your phone as well to keep you sane um, to put it non-dramatically um, but no I definitely feel like all the lessons I've learned through this whole thing kind of forget not to take your phone for granted and I think I did all these lessons learned eh, will be absolute rockets of humans after this 10 out of 10s um, 
But no, what doesn't kill you makes you stronger. Kelly Clarkson, blood is thick in the water. <laughs> That's shot for Cheyenne if she's watching. Um, but no, like relationships and friendships are growing stronger. Who knows? Sometimes in bad situations you have to take the good out of them. And that's all we can do right now. Focus on the good and what we have and what we want to achieve and how we want to live our lives moving forward. Personally for me, I want to take up a new hobby. I want to go singing lessons. I really do recommend 10, 20 minute walk out or even fresh air. If you're lucky enough to have an outdoor space, balcony, garden, front garden, have a little soak in the sun um, and if you can obviously go out for a walk or just open a window um, it helps so much uh, is that a crow there oh that's a scary looking crow crows terrify me like if there was a crow in front of me I'd cross the road <laughs> oh my god I can smell the sea Oh, I want seafood. Oh my God, hello. Little ducks. Oh my God, they have a little house. What's happening? Oh, look at them. Hello. Hello guys, so I'm back at my flat now. Um, what a lovely little walk that was. Currently listening to, oh God, what is it? I keep forgetting the bloody name. Shagged Married Avoid. I'm listening to Shag Married Annoyed. If you're from the UK, you would know the BBC3 show, Snog Marry Avoid. Really enjoying it, love their accents. The Julie accent is up there, top tier, love it. Right, so I'm back with Zoe now. I'm just about to tell her about my little walk. It was beautiful. Was it? Yeah. Sat by the pond, it was lovely. Oh, good. Yeah. What, what, my, oh. <laughs> That's on my YouTube video. Well, enjoy. <laughs> Alfie just flashed his behind. <laughs> his behind? His behind. What should we tell him to make for lunch? I didn't really see what it is. It's a cheeky early afternoon self-care session. No, we're doing that later. Oh, okay. Self-care. What do you mean? Just a little pick me up. How? Come on, guys. Face mask, eye mask. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Thumbnail. Thumbnail. <laughs> now, do I do something I know you love? Or do I do something that I love? <laughs> do whatever you want, sweetheart. Nala. Nala. I'm just assuming you might have these things in your cupboard. Yeah. So fingers crossed. Got some bagel. Bagel, halloumi. So you toast the halloumi. Hummus. Yeah. Spinach. Yeah. Avocado. Yeah. And a little. Um, I mean, you might not have this at all, <laughs> but like, put a little bit of um, chipotle sauce. Oh, I've got burger relish. Yeah, go for that. <laughs> yeah. Get cracking. Maybe a packet of crisps on the side. Oh, a pizza flavoured packet of crisps. Yeah. Guys, currently at my fridge, I've got halloumi. Been wanting to try this hummus for a while. It's the Leon lemon. Leon hummus with extra virgin olive oil. And some baby spinach. And the bagels I've got. Um, oh, avocado. Um... I don't have avocado. Wonder if I could use an onion. Oh. Let's get the bagels out. Gluten free. Oh, pardon me. Oh, I never put you here. It feels weird. I'm totally gluten free now because it just really upsets my stomach if I don't. Got my little Christmas chopping board out as I would be proud. We're going to start off by um, obviously cutting the bagel in half. Can you do that, Mark? Yeah, okay. So this is the house relish sweet and tangy with tomato gourmet burger kitchen 
relish. Um, apparently I was feeling very bougie that day and didn't set all the Sainsbury's home. Treat yourself sometimes. Let's slice a few um, bits of halloumi. For me. <laughs> Gonna turn that right down. Um, I'm gonna cut the onions. I know I shouldn't be um, complaining or whatever, but what I'd give, <laughs> what I'd give to be in Spain right about now with going into one of the supermarkets, being like, hola, que tal, me amo Mark, and then asking for like a long baguette filled with like tuna mayonnaise and raw onion, white onion. I should have been going to Gran Canaria this weekend with um, my friends, but who knows? One day it'll happen, for now, we've got to live in the moment, keep strong, keep happy, and just focus on what matters the most, and that is health, family, and mental health. I'm sure there's a few other things as well. Oh, give me that hummus, bitch! I remember when I bought this, I was like, the packaging for this is really bad. I'm gonna have to put tin foil over it or something. What we're going for today is we're going for American style bagels. Let's whack the halloumi on hun buns. In future, to help protect the environment, I'm just gonna make my own hummus after I've tried this, but I've always wanted to try this um, Leon hummus, if that's okay. <laughs> hey! Hey, y'all. I traded an avocado with onion. Oh, great. Yeah? That's fine. Did you cook the onion or is it raw? Oh, it's raw. Is that you nice? like raw onion? Love raw onion. Oh, he does like raw onion. Mm. I remember making a bagel, a, a big old French stick, and you filled it with raw onion. <laughs> <laughs> I really literally just up. mentioned that in my video. Shut up. Yeah, I was like, I want to go to Spain and have like a raw onions baguette. With tuna. <laughs> oh, that is true, actually. Tuna and more onion. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Have you seen normal people? No! Okay, so watch episode one of that. Okay. Mmm. This is a skill, guys, balancing on my knee. I think I should have toasted the bacon. Oh, uh, the bagel. <laughs> I'm so low. Oh, that is delightful. I just love food that has a crunch, like raw onion. I just love, like the crunch of a raw onion. I'm so weird. All very healthy food, apart from these probably. But um, yeah, I'm just about to have a little chill, watch lovely people, um, normal people, and I'll update you in a bit. So guys, I've just, um, finished watching the first episode of Normal People. It was great. I love this. I love the Irish accent. I thought, what would I do if I had the afternoon? I would do a bit of baking. Oh. What do I love to watch Mark Ferris do? <laughs> baking. Attempt. What can Mark Ferris not do? Baking. <laughs> That's unfair. I think you'll get it better. Thank you. Yeah. So. <laughs> The recipe I'm giving you, only because I know you've got lemons. Got lemons. Got lemons. I did actually ask Mark what he had mm. so that I could try and create a bake that he could actually do. So, what we're doing is a lemon drizzle cake. Lemon <laughs> drizzle. Have you ever made one of these before? Never. Oh. They got Are you excited? I'm nervous. I love the idea of the drizzle. Excuse me, Nella. <laughs> <laughs> I found you a very, very recipe. Love him. Nella! <laughs> <laughs> Can you explain that that was a joke? Yeah. <laughs> You, I'm gonna need it. Bye. <laughs> You're gonna do great. Thank you. I've taken the dungarees off. Not gonna lie, wearing jeans in this heat, <sighs> it's hot. I am prepared. Who am I? Let me just tuck my t-shirt in. 
we have got everything that I need here. Because sometimes I'm like, I'm always like, part of my baking videos, which I, I know you guys love, is that I'm always measuring out stuff wrong. But we got this, we're on it. I've got a whisk, I've got a, I've got a food blender. We all know this, okay? We've got a food blender and it works just as well. So 175 grams of castor sugar, 175 grams self-raising flour, 175 grams softened butter, three eggs, um, three quarter level hair teaspoon of baking powder, um, one juice of a lemon, 100 grams of granulated sugar, and an electric whisk. I'm excited for a lemon drizz. Okay, so preheat the oven to 180 degrees. Gas mark four. Beat together the eggs, flour, caster sugar, butter, baking powder, and lemon zest. Now we're going to pour this into the baking tin. Oh, I'm so excited for this. Alexa, set the timer for 35 minutes, please. So, one thing I'm definitely going to take away from this whole quarantine, isolation, lockdown sort of thing um, is that when I am in the kitchen and I'm cooking stuff and I'm using so many things, especially when I'm baking, um, I tend to just do the food cooking, chill, forget, wait till the next day to do all the cleaning up, and since this whole lockdown thing's been a thing, I haven't really been wanting to sit or be around that sort of like cloud of mess. So, so whilst this has been in the oven and I've been away from this, I've literally just been pottering around, washing up, cleaning up, organizing, putting things back in, and it really makes me feel better. Um, I don't know where I'm going with this story, but it just feels good. Okay guys, what do we think? Oh God, it said golden brown. It doesn't look as bad as it does on the screen. Just popping some holes in it just to make sure it's cooked. And it is, um, it looks like a little chicken, not gonna lie, little chicken leg, little chicken wing. Also FYI, I've changed because I spilt stuff all down my t-shirt. So I'm wearing this cute little lounge set from ASOS. While the cake is still warm, make the lemon drizzle topping, mix together the sugar and lemon juice and pour over the warm cake. If it's okay, I'm just gonna cut it to make it a little less crazy looking. Hope you don't mind. So we're just gonna cut that edge off. <gasps> Leave that to the side. Ready to pour? I actually don't think that's half bad. Just gonna try a little bit. See what we're working with. My God. Mmm. Oh my God, that's so good. I literally didn't think too much about it. I didn't put any pressure on myself. And look at that, absolute boss that. Zoe's gonna be so proud. So we're just sorting out dinner time now. I'm just ringing Zoe and you'll get to see her reaction to my lemon cake. Lemon drizzle cake. Hey, where are you? I can't kind of see you. <laughs> <laughs> you ready to see the creation? I am so ready. <laughs> <laughs> that looks good. Do you think? Why is it got so many like cracks in it? <laughs> so basically. <laughs> I put it in greaseproof paper, like baking parchment. If I was at your house, yeah. What do you think I would suggest? <gasps> Doms. 
Yeah! Yay! <laughs> I've had so much bread today. <laughs> well, let's just add a little bit more of it. <laughs> Diet. <laughs> it's the best though. Carbs are the best. Definitely get some garlic cheesy twists. Oh, okay. Because I can't get them round where I am, so I'm going to live vicariously through you. Oh, I save you one. <laughs> save me one. I've still got you two Easter eggs. Do you know how excited I am for them? <laughs> So I've just cut the cake into little bits. Um, so excited to have this with a cup of tea, but I just wanted to show you inside. I'm super happy with this, you know. So Domino's is on the way. Um, the garlic little twists were sadly um, not available for today, but I went ahead and got a large veggie supreme. Today's been fine. It's been like living... Um, Living the day in Zoe's shoes. She did say I should have done it with Alfie because he does more crazy ideas. But I'm like, I don't want crazy ideas. Alfie has sent me up to B&Q and I'll be making a skate ramp in my living room and I can't be doing that. Oh, 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 oh. absolutely divine. It kills more than rats. But no, sir, we have four heroes. Okay. Mm. That medic's apprentice. And his finger. I just want to kiss that finger. How is it? How are you doing? I'm all right. I'm getting there, and I. Right. What you got planned for me, love? I would like you to have the ultimate bath. Oh, <gasps> nice. Glass of red. Oh, okay. Wait, you don't drink red, do you? Oh yeah, I love red. Oh, you do. Okay, glass of red. I want. Bubbles. Loads of bubbles. Have you got any bath, like anything like a bath bomb or any fizzlers or? The watermelon and mint bath salts. Yeah. Then some bubbles. What flavour of bubbles? We've got. What, what options have we got? Freezer and pear. Ooh. Or white jasmine and peony. And what? <laughs> oh, I've said it wrong, and I. I'm going to say the first one. Freezer. Have you got any, like, new products? Oh, my God. Funny you should say that. So, it's the Pearl de Coco Glow Body Lotion and other stories. Ooh, what is it? Like, is it a fake tanner? It's a, it's like a sort of glowy sort of bath um, lotion. Milky coconut, cruising seas of warm vanilla and sweet caramel. Like Nice. Okay. And no phone time. No phone. Okay. No scrolling. No scrolling. Yeah. Deal. Okay. Bye. Thank you.